Hello, this is Mayor Steve Carrington for Palmer. I want to take you five days into the future for our October 11th City Council meeting at 6 p.m. So coming up for that meeting, we've got uh, a resolution concerning uh, certifying the election. We just had an election, and then also with that will be the administration of oath of office for six, five council members and a mayor. So in that will be the, uh, the council members that were re-elected will be uh, Carlina Anzalotti, Josh Tudor, John Alcantara, Richard Best, Thomas Ojala, and myself, Steve Carrington, as mayor. And uh, those, some of those are one-year terms, some are two-year terms, and some are three-year terms. And then we also have, of course, uh, approving the previous meeting, meeting minutes. The previous meeting minutes. And then under reports, the city manager's report has a presentation of capital requests and a presentation approval of project funding requests. Um, and that's just set up for looking at what are the, some of the big purchases we need to do, usually large vehicles, um, any expansion for water, sewer, etc. Some of those things that cost sometimes up into the millions. And then we, under public hearings, we have adoption of an official zoning district map that basically just is updating our map and we're adopting it as so that any of the changes that have happened in zoning in the last number of years will be reflected in the map. There's also a resolution for um, capital project priorities and that's tied with the manager's report. He'll be reporting and then there's a resolution for uh, the council to actually state these are the, our official uh, priorities that we have. And those we have in on usually a one or two page sheet that we can hand out whether we're going to Juno or we're talking to uh, senators or representatives for down in DC, et cetera. That there's a, a, a simple list that we've put together that shows the things that we're prioritizing now. We also have action memoranda number 22-058 uh, is working on a professional service agreement. The manager is supposed to work with HDL to come up with one for the uh, constructing the apron E project and the layout plan. There's also uh, action memorandum 22-059, uh, which has to do with purchasing two patrol vehicles and equipment to go with them for about 75,000. Um, every once in a while we need to update our fleet and we're usually rather good at using our equipment well well past normal life expectancy so I'm sure those are quite needed. In action memorandum number 22-054 authorizing utility connection for Quantum Laundry Lounge out on South Woodworth Loop, Palmer, Alaska. And normally the council doesn't get into approving uh, utility additions but this is uh, this is something that's just outside our city limits, and we have a, a water sewer district that goes out much bigger than our actual city limits, and so we're allowed to do that, but we have to, the council has to approve it specifically. And then, as far as coming up in future meetings, I mentioned, or I should mention, there's a, a, a public forum on acute vagrancy with a focus on actionable solutions. This has been put together by Deputy Mayor Pam Moline. And I believe we're advertising it, so it may be possible that um, multiple council members will be there. We're, we're not sure how many. It's not an actual council meeting, but a public forum. And because of our interest in it, some of us may be there. So we will uh, advertise it as such that there could be three or more of us there. Uh, and then coming up, we've got October 25th is our regular meeting at the end of October. November 1st is a special meeting about the budget. November 8th would be a regular meeting, probably lots of information about the budget. November 15th is a special meeting about the budget. And a regular meeting November 22nd, probably a lot of it about the budget. And those all start at 6 p.m. And I believe we have a couple more uh, public forums. I think one in October... I want to say the 26th, right after our regular meeting, a public forum talking about the right-of-way, the railroad right-of-way through the middle of town, and trying to have the public come and discuss what we think are our, um, what, what are our priorities, well, how do we want to develop that area, and then 
we have to go and speak with the railroad and come up with a permit to, to make that happen. And I believe that is on the 26th, but we'll uh, let you know more information as we get it. So this has been Steve Carrington, Palmer Mayor, taking you five days into the future. <laughs>